Hi, I'm Robert Davi, uh, talking about One in the Gun. I play a character named Vincent. And it's uh, uh, this is a new twist on the film noir movies. In other words, film noir for the for the 2010. It's a uh, a lot racier, uh, but it has all those elements of those twists. Um, my name is Violin. I'm at the movie premiere. You can look around behind me. It's kind of exciting. Uh, hi, my name is Rolf Kanevsky. I'm the writer director of the uh, film noir One in the Gun. Um, film noir is a genre that was started in the 40s. It started from German Expressionism and really what it was attempt to do a kind of low budget studio film where you could have minimal uh, sets and just very dark lighting. So they created kind of this uh, you know, sort of avant-garde uh, feel to a movie that usually required bad things happening to bad people, but you still like them. But the idea, I guess, the, the best way to describe it is the, the famous um, uh, Billy Wilder's Double Indemnity, which is one of the most famous film noirs, is that, you know, these movies are a guy usually, I did it for the money, and I did it for the girl, and I didn't get the money, and I didn't get the girl. That's film noir. And that's pretty much sums it up. <laughs> My name is Stephen Bauer, and I want to talk about One in the Gun. It's a film, um, film noir, modern film noir, uh, written and d directed by Rolf Konevsky. And I, um, I play a very uh, manipulative character, a uh, married man who uh, is trying to steal from himself, basically. Anyway, it's a, it's a beautifully uh, crafted and, uh, and co complicated and deliciously uh, uh, sleazy uh, story. I'm Stephen Mann, and I'm the star of One in the Gun. My character's name is Mickey, and he is the typical film noir guy that gets shafted at the end of the movie. He doesn't get the money, he doesn't get the girl, and he gets knocked off. Hi, I'm Katherine Randolph. I play Katrina Webb in One in the Gun. I am the film fatale in the film. Um, it was a lot of fun to shoot. I get to be a little bit evil, which is always a good time. What did you think of the movie? I love the movie. There were so many twists and turns. I can't even remember like what the ending was. I'm just caught up in how many different endings and twists and... It was wild, and it was fun and intense, <laughs> and I loved Robert Dobby in it. What did you guys think of the film? Uh, I thought it was amazing, actually. Um, a, lot of, a lot of really, really good shots. The styling was great. Uh, I liked a lot of the, uh, the characters in the film, so I thought they added a lot of uh, quirkiness to it. Yeah, I loved it. whoever the, the bartender was, or not the bartender, yeah, the girl that was singing at the end, that was uh, great. I loved it. I didn't know what was going to happen. It was very funny, and I just, it was beautifully done. Once you think that you have it all figured out, then something happens where you don't. So it kind of kept you on the edge of your seat. I thought it was interesting. It kind of brought me back to that whole film noir, Hitchcock type of thing that we're missing in Hollywood these days, so that was nice.